Hello, my horror movie fans. How in the heck are you? Geriatric Geek here. I'm doing great. It's a beautiful morning here in uh, North Las Vegas. It's going to be mid-80s. Just beautiful. Anyway, I hope you're doing as well as I am. I, as you already know by the title, have received my horror pack movies. Yay! I always look forward to this time of the month to get uh, some new horror movies and uh, hopefully they'll be new right uh, occasionally there's things that I've seen before but not very often not very often so I've got the both the blu-ray and the DVD I don't know which was which I just took them out of their boxes so we're gonna get into these and see what they've sent us for May of 2018 horror pack Yay! Okay, so this one feels like it's DVDs. Yeah. Let's just dig right in. First one. Alright. Never seen this one. That's a good thing. Called Below Zero. Below Zero. It's got one of my favorite actors on there. That's uh, Berryman. Michael Berryman. Like I said, I've not seen this movie, but um, I really like Berryman in uh, the uh, The Hills Have Eyes. Good job. But this looks really good. It says Hell Never Freezes Over. Trapped in an abandoned slaughterhouse. A desperate screenwriter paralyzed by writer's block is tormented by a horrific serial killer of his own creation. So there you go. I like it. Number one. Good job. Haven't seen it. Number two. I called Temple from the writer of Your Next and Blair Witch and the executive producer of The Ring Trilogy. Called Temple. This is a 2017 movie. I, I'm not a fan of movies that have spirits in them and you know that are awakened from ruins and that kind of thing. And I'm afraid that's what this is. It says three American tourists follow a mysterious map deep into the jungles of Japan, searching for an ancient temple. When spirits entrap them, their adventure quickly becomes a horrific nightmare. So, spirits from temples. I haven't seen that one, though. Probably won't watch it for a while. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of the spirits. Well, this is one I will like, though. This is a smiley. Evil wears a smile. Creepy looking guy, right? This is a 2002 film. Horror slasher type, I guess. Like it. A twisted killer let loose. A college student yearning for a fresh start. Internet trolls looking for trouble. I like these kind of internet troll kind of movies too. So, Okay, last one of the DVDs. This is not really a horror film. I guess it could be horrific to those involved, right? Called Sanctum. Of course, this was done by James Cameron before he did... Let's see, this is from um, 2011. Yeah. From executive producer, producer James Cameron. Thrilling underwater adventure based on true events. I didn't know that. Okay. So they go into a cave system, get stuck in there, and then they have to get out. That would not be fun for me. I am a scuba diver and have had issues like that where you, we've gone in tunnels and you get so far in and it gets totally black and next thing you know your tank is hitting on the top and you're think you're stuck scary shit <laughs> that's real thriller there 
anyway, so that's the DVDs. What do you guys think? What should I watch first? Let me know. Very good. Okay, so let's do the Blu-rays then. Always look forward to the Blu-rays because they have uh, exclusive ones generally. So here we go with the first one. Uh, well, it's not starting off great, I mean, as far as whether I've seen them before or not. But this is the last house on the left, collector's edition, unrated. Of course, this is written and directed by Wes Craven, Blu-ray edition. This originally came out in 1972, I believe. It's a really good movie, I thought. It is indeed a slasher thriller. This one was released in 2010. That's where some kids are kidnapped by some convicts. Could be scary. That's a good movie. I, I just, you know, I already have it many times over. Okay, next up is Stonehurst Asylum. I like asylum movies. Because I used to work in one for a college internship. It's a 2014 movie. It's based on a story done by Edgar Allan Poe. More of drama, I would say, than horror, I think. When young Dr. Edward Newgate, Newgate arrives at Stonehurst Asylum in search of an apprenticeship, he is warmly welcomed by Superintendent Dr. Lamb, Ben Kingsley, a lot of uh, famous people in this, Kate Beckinsale, Jim Sturgis, Brendan Gleeson, Ben Kingsley, and Michael Kane. Uh, so, their modern methods of treating the insane until a series of unusual events leads him to make a horrifying discovery. Okay, we'll check it out. I've never, uh, never seen it. Don't have it. Next up, uh, this is the Horror Pack exclusive. I've not seen this one either. It's called The Black Dahlia Haunting. I've heard of The Black Dahlia, not this haunting. This is a 2013 movie, and of course this, this version is um, 2017 by Horror Pack. Very cool, this is number 22 in their, in their offerings. So it's about, looks like a, a woman trying to deal with the brutal murder her, of her father and stepmother by her younger brother, Tyler. So, looks interesting. I will give that a watch eventually. And last but not least, in the May 2018 horror pack, Blu-rays, we have Resolution. Puts the cabin in the woods to shame. Peter Salella and Vinnie Curran. Resolution, 2012 movie. In an abandoned cabin on the edge of an Indian reservation, Mike stages a risky intervention to force his friend Chris off meth and into rehab, but what begins as an attempt to save his friend's life takes an unexpected turn when ominous threats start appearing around the house and they realize that Chris's addictions are the least of their worries. Looks like a fun one. So there you go. That's Horror Pack for May 2018. Let me know what you think. Uh, what should I watch first? Are there any of these much better than the other ones? So let me know. I'm going to watch uh, most of them. So anyway... If you like this video and you want to see more unboxings, consider giving me a thumbs up, a like, and subscribe to this channel because I do this every month. And you know, if you're a horror movie buff and you don't want to spend the time going out looking around, which I do, but you know, if you want it just delivered to your door, uh, Horror Pack 
good job. Uh, they bring you uh, DVDs and Blu-rays every month that uh, certainly fill the bill, and <clears throat> I'm looking forward to uh, what, to see what they come up in the future. So, that being said, from North Las Vegas, you guys have fun. Oh, I'll leave a link in the description below where you can get your own horror pack. And if you use the link that I put there, I'll save a couple of bucks, and you'll save a few bucks too. So, that being said... From North Las Vegas, keep smiling, keep having fun, keep watching those scary movies. Peace.